and that'll be the makeup of our team and uh, going forward that's what we're going to have and uh, that's the way it's going to be from here on out uh, any other questions uh, Glenn yeah go ahead you got a question there buddy yeah, Kevin Reid, and uh, thanks for recognising your buddy. Uh, listen, I got a, a small uh, eight-part question, if you don't mind. Uh, first part, Kevin, um, you drafted Sam Gagne uh, and took him right from junior to the NHL. Uh, Kevin, uh, if you could go back, uh, you had your time back, uh, would, would you change that at all? Yeah, very good question there, Glenn. Yeah, if we had our time back with Sam, uh, we probably uh, would have left him in junior and then uh, developed him uh, maybe in minors and uh, then brought him up that way. Yeah, for sure. No doubt about that. Yeah, right under Kevin. Uh, uh, Kevin, uh, you drafted uh, Jordan Everly, uh, took him right from junior and brought him to the NHL. Uh, if you could go back in time, uh, would you change anything about that? Yeah, great question, Glenn. Uh, you know, Jordan's a very good player for us right now, but uh, it took a long time for him to come along. But uh, if I could go back uh, in time and uh, maybe uh, get him some more development, uh, for sure I would totally do that, yeah. Yeah, right on, Kevin, thanks. Uh, uh, Kevin, uh, when you drafted uh, Taylor Hall, you took him right out of junior and brought him to the NHL. Uh, you know, if you could go back in time now, uh, would, you, would you change anything about that? Yeah, good question, Glenn. Yeah, you know, uh, Taylor's a very good player in the league right now, uh, especially for us. Uh, any team would be glad to have him. But uh, looking back on it, it took a long time for him to get where he's to. Uh, if I had a chance to uh, get him some more uh, time in the juniors and maybe bring him to the AHL and develop him, bring him along a little better, uh, yeah, for sure, I would totally do that if I could go back and change things. Yeah, right on, Kevin. Uh, you drafted uh, Ryan Nugent Hopkins out of junior, brought him right to the NHL. If you could go back in time, him being a center and very small, uh, would there be anything that you would uh, do over or change about that? Yeah, Glenn, uh, good question. Uh, yeah, Ryan Nugent Hopkins came in. Uh, he's very small at center, very important position uh, on, the, on the ice. Uh, if I could go back and uh, change things, I would have uh, left him in junior and uh, brought him along a little slower for sure. Yeah, good question. Yeah, right on, Kevin, thanks. Uh, listen, uh, you, you got the, uh, Justin Scholl signs a free agent at the uh, American College ranks, right? Uh, if you go back in time and uh, change anything about that, uh, you know, would you? Yeah, looking back at Declan, that's a no-brainer, totally. Uh, I would totally have left him uh, and brought him along, especially at defence. Uh, it's a it's a tough position, uh, but, uh, yeah, sure, uh, we should have did that for sure. If I could go back, I would totally do that. Yeah, right on. Thanks, Kevin. Uh, listen, uh, you drafted uh, Neil Yakupov right, right out of junior and uh, brought him right to the NHL uh, at center. Or, uh, again, uh, uh, would, you, uh, would you change things uh, with him if you could go back and do it? Yeah, Glenn, uh, for sure. Looking back at that now, we totally should have did that. And if I could go back, that's exactly what I would do. Yeah, good question. Right on, thanks, Kevin. Uh, listen, uh, you drafted uh, Leon Dreisaitl right out of the junior, brought him to the NHL like, again at center. Uh, you know, uh, if you had your time back, uh, would you do anything different? Yeah, totally, Glenn. Uh, we brought him in and, uh, you know, he really struggled and uh, we would put him back now after 40 games. But uh, if I had my time back, totally would have left him uh, playing junior and uh, and uh, brought him along that way for sure. Uh, good question, yeah. Well, Kevin, you know, looking back right on your tenure here as, uh, with the Oilers uh, making the decisions that you made, Kevin, it's obvious to see that, uh, you know, you don't, you don't make the same mistakes over and over again. You like you make a mistake and you learn from it. And you move on and you know you keep on. You won't keep making the same mistakes over and over. And you learn uh, your decision making is really, uh, really amped. Uh, Kevin, uh, how do you, how do you explain such good decision making and uh, and uh, not making mistakes like other teams do? How do how do you explain that? Yeah, yeah, good question, Glenn. Uh, well, you know, uh, it's it's very obvious to me and to anyone who has any clue about hockey. Uh, if you just look at my uh, my track record, uh, it's obvious that I know a thing or two about winning, right? Yeah, thing or two about winning. Yeah, that's right, Kevin. Yeah, good, good. That's, that's a good answer, buddy. Thanks, buddy.